A teenage boy is dead, another hospitalized after a late night shooting in San Leandro. Police say it is unclear what led up to the gunfire. And as Crown Force Philippe Dugal reports tonight, the suspects are still out there. Believe me, I was trying so hard to sleep. I still remember his face asking for help. After hearing gunshots outside his home at the St. Moritz Gardens Apartments on Washington Avenue in San Leandro Tuesday night, a neighbor first made sure his own kids were okay, then went outside just after 9 o'clock and consoled who he believes is the 16-year-old boy who eventually died at a hospital while suffering from gunshot wounds sustained on the sidewalk. The man feels for the victim's family. I am so much in pain with them as well. It, it's just, it sucks. Another kid gunned down. That's sad. That boy will make me cry. A 17-year-old boy was also wounded by gunfire. San Leandro police say he was hospitalized in stable condition. Shaquana Benson says her teenage daughter was friends with the boy who died. That baby didn't even make it to 18. Like, it's devastating. That could have been my child. Like, it's just sad. How's his mom feeling? His dad feeling? You know, his sister and him, and like his brother and him, like they're not doing good. People are sad. Like this is devastating. Like this is our children. Investigators say they are looking for at least one shooter. The neighbor who spoke with the homicide victim and called police says he saw a car speed off, but could not provide a description. The gun violence needs to stop. It just really have to stop. Kids need to grow up. At this time, police have yet to release a motive or announce any arrests. In San Leandro, Philippe Chagall, Cron 4 News.